Hi, my name is Joe Zagami and I'm the director of My Therapy NYC. And I'm here to share with you the difference between a relationship want and a relationship need. Let's discuss the difference. A relationship want, we all have them and we should have them. When thinking about a relationship want, we should think with the mindset, what will make me happy? Because we all deserve to be happy. It's important to keep in mind that we should distinguish between what we want from, the, from what society and what others may want for us. Don't worry about being superficial. These are your relationship wants. They're an expression of who you are and what makes you happy. So you shouldn't be ashamed of them. And I hate to break it to you, you're probably not going to get all your relationship wants from your future partner. No one is perfect and you can't get everything from one person. However, you should expect to get your relationship's needs met. So what's a relationship need? Those are the non-negotiables. Those are the essential things that you need to make a relationship work. For instance, let's just say having children is very important to you. It's a non-negotiable. It's the very thing that will make you happy. And let's just say you meet somebody who doesn't want children. So it doesn't make sense to waste your time and energy to pursue a person who's not going to be able to fulfill your relationship needs. Too many of my clients stay in relationships way too long when they know the other person's not going to fulfill their relationship needs. So it's important and to respect yourself and the other person to learn to let go when you know that someone's not going to fulfill your relationship needs. So what's a good way to figure out your wants and needs? Well, I encourage all my clients to write a list, a list of all the traits that they want in an ideal partner. Those are your wants. Then go through that list and circle all the traits in which are non-negotiable, the essential traits that you absolutely need. Those are your needs. No, your list may evolve, and that's okay. Your wants and needs may come and go, but the most important thing is that you have a list and that it's clear. So when dating someone seriously, take out that list. Make sure that they're going to be meeting your needs first. If so, continue dating, and hopefully they're going to be meeting some of your wants as well. I value your input, so please, Feel free to share some of your comments below. Good luck and happy dating.